Hey guys, Chris Smith here. Uh, today I wanted to talk to you about something called the Law of Three. And I heard about this from Brian Tracy, who uh, wrote one of my favourite books called Eat That Frog. It's all about um, stopping you procrastinating. So if you do find you keep putting things off, um, that's a good book to have a look at. Um, but the Law of Three basically states that in your, your life, or your business in particular, you will probably find three things that account for 90% of all of your income, your, your business growth. Um, obviously you do lots of other things in your life, so you know lots of admin and other bits, but they're not directly generating income. So what you should be doing is looking at all the different things that you're doing related to your business, identify the three things that are actually generating income. If you stop doing those, your, you know, your business would basically go downhill. And then you should decide spend more time on those three things. Have a look at the things that you're doing that you, know, you might find that the other 50% or 60 or 70% of your time on other things is actually contributing nothing to your business. It, it's kind of overheads and admin that you need to do, but you shouldn't be focusing time and energy on those things. You should be focusing on those three things. So, just to give you an example, in my business, in Clean Easy, the three things that I really should be focusing on my uh, attentions and time on are firstly supporting my team members, my, my sort of new team members especially when they're first getting started, and um, secondly generating leads so that I can find new team members, and then thirdly calling those leads, following up, making sure they've got the information, building some rapport with them so that they might want to join our team. So those three things are the key things for growing my business. and. I've been doing a bit of tracking of my time. If you listen to my previous video, watch my previous video about tracking things to see where you're spending your time. Um, I was looking at that and what I found was I'm spending about 25 to 30% of my time doing that. Um, I'm spending about 35 to 40% of my time doing kind of personal retail to my own customers, putting the catalogs out, delivering the orders to them, that sort of thing, collecting the catalogs back up again. And then the rest is you know, a bit of infrastructure stuff, writing my blog posts and things, which is valuable but not kind of bringing business straight away. Um, and then admin, overheads and stuff that, you know, sort of necessary evils, if you like. So um, what I'm planning to do now is really focus on where I'm spending my time and shift stuff from the less important to those three key important things. Um, I would suggest you do the same. Okay, guys, see you soon. Bye for now.